Hi, in this short video, I'm going to show you how to work with text using the Web Starts page editor. Once you're in the Web Starts page editor, hover over the text that you would like to edit and then click to select it. Next, click the attached edit icon and select the text that you would like to type over. Type over whatever you would like and you can see that the contents of the text box have been edited. To change the appearance of text, highlight to select it. You can apply a default font style to your text by selecting it from the change style dropdown. To edit those defaults, click on the edit icon. To change the font, select a new font from the font family dropdown menu. Increase or decrease the size of your font using the slider. Apply font formats like bold, italic, and underline. Change the color of your font. Click on the font color icon and then select the new color you would like from the color palette. Select the justification tool to justify your text to the left, center, or right. To create a link, click on the link icon and select the type of link you'd like to create and where you'd like to link your text to. You can do things like apply bullets to text by selecting the text, selecting the bullet tool, and the bullet type. You can also indent your text either to the left or to the right using the indent tool. Use the line spacing tool to increase or decrease the amount of space between each line of text. The character spacing tool lets you either increase or decrease the amount of space between characters. You can apply H1 through H6 tags by selecting text and selecting the appropriate tag from the drop-down menu. To add text to a page, click Add, select Text, and then select the type of text box you would like to add to your page and drag it where you would like it to be displayed. Remove a text box by selecting it and then clicking the Remove Element icon attached to it. Like all elements in Web Starts, when you select the text box, you'll have the option to edit the content, edit the styles, align the content, duplicate the element, arrange it by layer, that means bring it forward or backward, adjust the settings, or remove the element by clicking the trash icon. That's it for this video on working with text in Web Starts. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.